guys, so I'm here today with Anne and Patrick Furlow with Set by Sage Interiors and they have some awesome design tips for you guys. If you're thinking about putting your house on the market, they're going to help you make your listing really sparkle. And if you're not thinking about selling, if you love right where you are but you want to make it prettier, they have some awesome tips for you. But before we begin, can you guys tell us about how you started your company? So I started Set by Sage Interiors in 2011 because I really saw the need in real estate to make spaces beautiful to help those buyers visualize themselves living in the space. And in 2018, Patrick came on board and we have been killing it making spaces beautiful and I think we've staged over a thousand houses in Polk County as nine years? That's right, just over nine years, just over a thousand homes in the Polk County and Central Florida area. At the end of the day, we help our clients sell their homes faster and for maximum profit. And for those living in their spaces, not looking to sell, we help with design aspects to make their home more engaging and inviting for their personal taste. So today, we'd love to talk to you guys about some tips on if you're selling your house or if you're dwelling and staying in your house, just some little things that can make your space look beautiful. Tip number one, always do layered lighting in your rooms. This makes it a little bit more cozy and a little bit more relaxed for the buyer or just for your guest. Make sure you always have ceiling light, natural light, and floor lamps. Design tip number two, if you're residing in your home and you really like that bold pop of color, Consider an accent wall or some festive wallpaper for the spaces that you like. If you're putting your house on the market, definitely consider painting your walls neutral if they're not neutral colors already. It's a great color for prospective buyers to see that space. So as Pat mentioned in tip number two, earthy tones are here to stay. They are awesome. And here we have shown on this bed, white bedding with very earthy pillows that have a nice texture to them, an oatmeal headboard, and then we really popped it with some blues and golds. So it looks perfect if you're either dwelling or if you're getting ready to sell. Tip number three. People love to look at different tile work in a house. So make it fun and interesting, whether it's a backsplash or a bathroom remodel, get creative, get fun, put some texture into it, put some pattern into it. It's really trending in 2020 and it's gonna be really hot in 2021. Design tip number four, be unique and be you. Everyone is always trying to do something that somebody else has already done. A great way to break that chain is to be able to find something local, local artists, local mm -hmm. furniture. It creates a unique space for yourself and defines your space for something that you like. Tip number five. Coming up in 2021, we are gonna be seeing a ton more furniture that has curves and arches and bubbly, kind of like the 1980s effect a little bit, but more in a contemporary manner. So I know I said 1980s, but I know you guys are gonna love it. It's awesome stuff coming out. We just are going to the furniture markets and we're gonna be using a ton of it in our stagings coming up. And I can't wait for you guys to see it. Well, thank you so much for joining us today on our channel and for all these amazing interior design tips. As a real estate agent, I cannot recommend Set by Sage Interiors enough. Every time that they have staged a home for me, we have gotten multiple offers and often well above asking price. Also sending a huge thank you to the listing agent at this beautiful property, Skepticism with Keller Williams Smart. I'm Danny Borro with the Flying Pigs Home team at Keller Williams Realty. If you like these real estate tips as well as more information about living in Lakeland and Polk County, please subscribe to my channel.